Over the past decade, Mark Tran has taken extra measures to make sure everyone in Marquette County, including the disabled, has access to public transportation. Tonight, TV6's Jennifer Perez has an up-close look at how it's helping a Chocolate Township woman. Gretchen Preston is heading to town on one of her monthly visits. For $1.60, she's doing it with the help of Mark Tran's door-to-door -door service. There are not bus routes uh, out here in rural Chocolate Township. They actually physically come to my home and then will drop me anywhere in uh, Marquette County that I need to go, which is just fabulous. It's a service she takes advantage of because she's blind. Now an accomplished children's book author, Preston's never let her disability get in the way. While she has the help of Floyd, her leader dog, she says if it wasn't for Mark Tran, she probably wouldn't have moved up here 15 years ago. How does Mark Tran help you keep your independence? The fact that I don't drive, um, I do have several friends and a personal assistant who can drive me to run errands, but sometimes I just like to go to town by myself. Currently, Mark Tran has nine fixed routes, including to Ishpeming and Nagani. According to Dylan Klein, throughout the years, they've also made several upgrades to help the disabled. We try to purchase all buses with lifts um, in the future, and I believe I only have one in my fleet that is not lift equipped. The rest are lift equipped. Preston uses Mark Tran at least two times every month to run errands and go to appointments. Buses are very comfortable and it has made a huge difference in me being able to uh, continue to be independent in uh, living rurally. Jennifer Perez, TV6 News, Marquette.